from Alabama in Israel right now when that war broke out. Church groups in Alabama working now to get their loved ones home. Tristan Rupert joins us now live. And Tristan, you've spoken with church leaders in Aniston and Coleman today. How are those groups doing? Morgan, I've been told that the church group from Aniston's in good spirits. That group is actually from the Hillcrest Baptist Church Group. There's 27 members actually in Israel right now. While their spirits remain high, they are physically exhausted. They are currently in North Israel trying to find plain spots to get out of the country, a challenge that many others are facing while in Israel at this moment. That includes another congregation member from a church up in Coleman. They've been stranded because their flight out of Tel Aviv has been canceled. Um, Delta is no longer doing any flights in or out of Tel Aviv. And so they've been trying to find their way across the border into Jordan and um, you know get out through the city of Amman. Tiffany Johnson and her church group were headed to Israel's northern border when Pastor Lawson says additional missile strikes forced them to seek shelter. The group that we are uh, trying to get out of Israel, they are right now, they're underground in bunkers because Hezbollah has attacked from the north. During their attempt to escape Israel, Pastor Lawson says Johnson's group encountered another church group from Ohio that is attempting to return home. Pastor Lawson says the church has spent over $40,000 in an effort to help get both groups back to the states. We're just trying to come around that family, support them, and you know do what we can physically do. But really the best thing we can do is pray and uh, call on a God that we trust and believe in. Pastor Lawson says that a group will be meeting at the church in the next few hours. They're going to be praying through about midnight tonight. That's when they believe that group's going to cross the Israel border, be in another country where perhaps they'd be at least a little bit more likely to find a flight back to the States. They're not the only group that's doing something, though. Uh, of course, the Hillcrest Baptist Group also hosting a prayer service tonight at 630. Uh, to find out more information about what either of these groups are doing, you can head over to the WBRC News app. Reporting in Birmingham, Tristan Rupert, WBRC. Fox 6 News on your side.